So I just finished my Facebook Live and I'm now home. And I'm going to make sure that I remove all the makeup that I put on my face so that hindi ako magkaroon ng clog pores, comedones, and breakout. So I like to use a balm cleanser. So it's um, an emulsion that melts away all the oil, the makeup, and the things that you put on your face. So I'm just gonna use this scoop. Put some on my fingers. Apply it on my face generously. So I also include my eyes because I put an eyeshadow. And my lips, although na tanggal siya dahil kumain na ako. The good thing about the emulsion is that once in contact with water, nawawala yung pagka-oily niya. But it brings with it all the oil and the foundation and the tube. You can literally see the makeup melting. I rinse it away with tap water. So depending on how thick my makeup is, as you can see, there's still left over. Um, pat dry. And if my mga tira pa, I usually apply a micellar cleanser on a cotton pad. So I'm gonna show you. So you can use disposable cotton pads. It's more environmentally friendly. But right now, what I have here are disposable cotton pads. And I use micellar cleanser. And I will show you later why it's also important to still do this. So, see? Meron pa rin. And then, if I feel that I still need to clean my face even more, then I wash with any cleanser. Um, what I'm going to use here is this one. It's has glycolic acid. So just gently rub it on your face. So this is also why it's very important to apply moisturizer afterwards. Because imagine I cleaned my face three times. So even if I used like a mild cleanser or a mild makeup remover, there's still that chance that um, those essential oils and fatty acids will be removed. So I'm just gonna wash your face. Be gentle when you dry your skin. Of course, you don't want to braid it and stretch it. So now I'm sure that my face is clean because it can only be dark circles cup and my pigmentation right there. I'm going to apply a moisturizer. Which one will I choose? So I haven't really applied my retinol in the past few days. So I'm going to use this. This has 0.4% retinol. And it's one of my favorite things to apply on my face. So just this one. And for the eye area, um, it also helps if you have an eye cream, especially if there are issues that you want to target like puffiness, um, fine lines, pigmentation. So there, I'm ready to go to bed.